tornadoes down there and the north side of the system is what's going to get us wet but it is all going to be just rain when it gets here those are the tornado reports we were talking about including a three that were just north of montgomery one of those uh, tornadoes actually reported on the ground so so far there's been damage but no reports of injuries with those tornadoes and tomorrow this could all spread to the carolinas right now it's a moderate risk but that surely uh, may go to high tomorrow as that system progresses to the east so let's start tracking our rain which again is not going to be anything compared to what we have down south but we will start to see those showers develop a little stripe here in the north zone by 3 a.m but the majority of that rain is going to be down in the south zone and watch as we go through the morning hours that's going to sink south so i think everybody's going to see a little bit of something as that stripe goes on down through the metro zone but once we get past about nine or ten o'clock all that rain is going to be confined to areas south of 94 so primarily the south zone as we head through the late morning and early parts of the afternoon by five o'clock it's all gone and we don't have to contend with rain again until tuesday of next week there your wind gusts tomorrow and because of that northeast wind which is going to be at least here at this frame around 40 miles per hour. But I think there could be some gust even higher than that. Significant flooding possible in Monroe County where that warning is in effect and advisories for lakeshore flooding all up and down the east side. So let's look at rainfall totals and no, the actual numbers are not all that impressive here, but you can see the difference between what we're going to get in the metro zone and what we're expecting down near the state line, which could be a half inch plus. Everybody else is going to be much less than that. In fact, just hundredths of an inch in most locations as we finish out our Thursday. So lows tonight heading down to 37 degrees, not nearly as mild tomorrow at 44, but we will make up for that over the weekend. 50 Saturday and Sunday, 60s caring for Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. So a lot of warmth to go after the rain. Not a bad way to start the work week with a 62 on a Monday. Yeah, could be uh, a lot worse. Yeah, sure <laughs> is. All right. Thank you, Ben. Yep.